Hello, hello, this is Rod, live within your means. Hey, look at this great big pile of leaves. That's a really good sized pile of leaves. It's probably about 12 or 13 feet long and about nine, eight or nine feet wide going that way. And uh, the top of it, you know, is over two feet tall. That's a lot of leaves. It'll fill a lot of garbage bags. Do you really want to fill all those garbage bags? Maybe you don't have a garden, a place to put compost, but if you don't, uh, one of the things that you can do to use less garbage bags is mow your pile of leaves with your lawnmower. You'll be amazed how little room those end up taking once they're beaten up by your lawnmower. And if you don't have a lawnmower that'll do that, then you can let it rain. We're, we're due to get a little bit of precipitation today or tomorrow. And you let it rain and they will take up a heck of a lot less room. Now granted, they're going to weigh more but they'll take a lot less room. And uh, wet leaves take a lot less room than dry room. You can use fewer garbage bags. Nevertheless, if you've got a neighbor that has a garden, I would encourage you to uh, take those leaves over to them after they take less room, especially if you can mow them up and have those in a lawn bag. Uh, and you can use that and dump them into a garbage bag. Uh, from a lawnmower bag, they're just going to take a lot less room. That's going to save you some money. And seeing how it is November and it's getting much, much colder, get the things you need. Make sure you keep your car, uh, keep gas in your car. You know, if it gets down halfway, um, don't ever run out of gas. That's just one of the things that we've all, a lot of us have done. It's pretty embarrassing, kind of a stupid thing to do. Get the groceries and things that you need. And uh, I put another video up that you're going to be seeing about what to do to save money with your lawnmowers so you don't spend so much getting those repaired. And it is November 6th, so I will be putting another video up shortly today or tomorrow, hopefully today, to tell you how to save money on your taxes. And part of it is getting out to vote, but it's also knowing who to vote for that's going to cost you a lot less money because there are some politicians out there that'll gladly increase your taxes and uh, they're going to ask you for bonds to borrow more money that you can pay interest on so that they can do all their pet projects and I'm going to be talking about how to identify those uh, people that you want to vote for a lot quicker and uh, and please share the video with others put some comments down below and uh, but anyway, this is Rod. Live within your means. Thank you for subscribing and have a wonderful day.